Hi, it's Meredith. It's Sunday, April 24th, 2016, and uh, tomorrow I'll be 48 weeks post-op, and I'll be 11 months post-op VSG surgery that I had on May 25th, 2015. Um, my high weight was 370, uh, surgery weight was 310, and uh, today I weighed in at 189.8. Um, I've gained 15 pounds in two weeks. I know that it's not a real uh, 15 pounds. Um, here's the deal. I have been having the weirdest digestive issues. It started out... Okay, I'm five foot four. I always forget to say my height. Um, it started out when I uh, would eat uh, foods highly concentrated in fats, so like nuts and seeds. Um, I felt like uh, all the way from my stomach through my bowels that I was just getting shredded apart. Um, and now, no matter what I eat, um, I get some sort of intestinal distress. Uh, so, I get really nauseous even just drinking plain water. So I have not been keeping up on my hydration. And, um, I know that most of that 15 pounds is just water weight because, uh, yeah, I'm really very bloated. I can see it everywhere. I am just puffy in my hands and my feet and, um, and my stomach is like bulging out. It's just, yeah. I went into urgent care again yesterday because I started shaking uncontrollably and I didn't know what was going on. Um... I got a HIDA scan done on Friday because we think it might be my gallbladder, but my ultrasound came back clean that I had on Tuesday. I just, it's all over the place. And I reached a point this week where um, I just said, screw it. And I just went into the grocery store and I bought everything that looked good. And, um, I Windexed a lot of things, a lot of food. Uh, guys, I bought just crap. I'm not even going to sugarcoat it. I bought crap. I didn't eat all of it. I sprayed Windex on a lot of things, and a lot, a lot of the stuff that I bought made me sick. Um, anyway, so... Yeah, I just reverted back to old behaviors this last week. Just food was making me uncomfortable, and so illogically I decided to return to food for comfort. And then it made me uncomfortable again. Two nights this week I thought I was going to have to call somebody to take me to the emergency room. It's been really bad. I've not worked out at all this week. Um, I've been struggling with extreme fatigue. I, I just, yeah... Nausea, constipation, diarrhea, um, abdominal cramping, noxious gas that I think will just kill anybody. The good thing I live alone. Um, I uh, anyway, going into urgent care yesterday um, because I had diarrhea all day Friday. My electrolytes were just really depleted, and so he said, "Just drink a gallon of Gatorade." Um, he said, "That's what's." more than likely causing your shakiness because I don't have any he ran a blood panel and I don't have any vitamin deficiencies or anything like that um, they took a urine sample and it just, just showed dehydration and everything and uh, it's been miserable <laughs> like it's just been bad they took an x-ray and he said you have a lot of stool just clogged up in your bowels. He said all of this could just be related to constipation. And um, so he prescribed that I take Miralax every day for a week. So I get to start those Miralax shakes tonight. Um, yeah, my goal for tomorrow is to just do liquid protein shakes all day. And and fast until, yeah, I don't know, and get another two gallons of water in. I'm 32 ounces away today from getting two gallons in. 
Sometimes I have to lie down because the nausea is so bad just from drinking plain water. And it doesn't matter if the water is flavored or not. I just, even drinking the Powerade Zero that I got yesterday, anything that I put in, it seems like any liquid that I put in, I just get nauseous. I'll get the results back from my HIDA scan tomorrow, and um, if those are clear, then they're going to do a scope. Maybe it is all related to constipation. A lot of these symptoms seem to be IBS kind of related to, but I'm just at the point where it's like, eh. so everything makes me sick. So I don't know. Today I returned to more healthy options. Uh, made some banana muffins to give away to friends, and I gave away most of them, and I've been eating, you know. They're sugar-free, grain-free, they're paleo, they're nut-free, they're, they just, I mean, so. Cat attacked me in the middle of the night. She just bit my face when I grabbed her because she thought that would be better. I don't know. In my hand, she got pretty darn good, too. She just went to town. I bled all over the place. Um, sorry. And my mind is all over the place. I had a couple of protein bars today that I just picked up at Walmart when I filled my prescription and picked up my Miralax. Um, doctor yesterday also prescribed some anti-nausea medicine, which I don't, I don't notice a difference when I take it. So, anyway, just... I'm about to make a Miralax shake now, and, um, yeah. If everything makes me sick, then, I mean, I need to keep eating, and, um, so I'm going to get back on to straight and narrow, liquid day tomorrow, liquid day Tuesday, and then I think, um, I might try a liver detox that I found, although... Maybe it's not, if it's not gallbladder related, I don't know. I hope we find out soon. All this came on so fast. So, and I want to try to work out tomorrow, but we'll see. I guess, I mean, I missed school Friday, and I came home early from school on Wednesday and Thursday. Like, this is ridiculous. So, okay. It is what it is. So, I'll see you guys later. I love you. Jesus loves you more.